What's up guys? Welcome back to some more House of the Dead Overkill. Jumping into Ballistic Trauma. The second episode, as you would say. Um, oh, I forgot. forgot how this game works. Can I change? Oh, gun shop. Um... Yeah, can I have a shotgun? I don't have enough money for a shotgun. Oof. Oof. Some good stuff here. I feel like... I feel like we need to, like, re like upgrade some stuff here. Clip size, I think, is going to be good. I think uh, we can do damage and reload. And we'll save it. We need, we need to pop off, you know what I mean? I wonder if you could play through the whole game with just the one... I wonder if we can just play through it with just the one... The one gun. I'm holding the nunchuck, and I don't think I'd need it for this game. <laughs> it seems really pointless. I guess it's giving my hand, my other hand, something to do. Washington and his associate are on their way. But if you guys would be so kind as press that thumbs up button and subscribe, it goes a long way in helping my channel out. Rest assured, Clement. I have a plan which will eliminate both of them and any evidence of our work here. Your symptoms: cold sweats, irregular heartbeat, anxiety. The diagnosis: bleeding horror that cuts like a scalpel to the heart. There is only one cure. A white hot boot to the brain. Ballistic trauma. Collect your point blank prescription. All right, let's do this. Hopefully, we won't have some areas that are so dark I can't see what's going on, but I have a feeling. Most of the game's gonna be pretty dark. There is a brain off to our left here. Oh man, I got a fever. Come on now, let me have that brain. All right, cool. I don't know, like, I think, like, you gotta do the objectives and stuff to... Take your motherfucking head. Yes, that Good, I don't say, I don't know how to... Well, they all got knives now? Say, so, man, I'm having a hard enough time with just, like, the... Trying to get the little like side stuff and it had there was something floating there wasn't there oh, i think i missed something here i don't know what i missed but Please don't shoot me. I ain't no mutant. Ooh, i got the civilian out good I want to unlock the shotgun. I bet the shotgun, from what I well, I bet from what I remember, the shotgun's fun. <laughs> I don't know how long each level is. I really don't. I like the added like film grain and stuff, like the film damage. I mean, damn it. Nice. Okay, this is awkward. I was like, am I gonna miss every shot, really? <laughs> Dude, I feel like I'm getting like a violent phone call. Is that Killer Mike? Did we just kill Killer Mike? I do. I feel like I'm getting a violent phone call. Maybe after this episode, we'll try to turn off the... Oh, I missed it. Oh, 
Oh, there's a thingy back there. Oh, really? We didn't have enough time for that. At least I didn't feel like we had enough time for that. When in doubt, reload it out. I don't trust you. Hey, wait. What is that? I didn't get it again. I kind of like if you get the slow-mo thing, it's kind of awkward for a second. I feel like that zombie was very much like hanging his head out. Oh, Killer Mike's back. Think so. Shit, it's coming through. I'll say them like I think they're grenades, I think is what that is over there. I'm alive. I'm motherfucking still alive. Yeah, just my luck. This game's insanely fun with two players. Ah! I don't like that, man. It just like turns the corner and they're like right up in your business. Oh, okay, you're dead. Oh, I only had like a... It's like, it flashes stuff so quickly, it's like... Yeah, it, does. it flashes stuff so quickly and like the aiming's awkward enough that it's like... It's like, uh, it might as well be impossible to get. I think I missed that one too. Dang it. I like the... Just the telephone in the background. I'm trying to get a lot of headshots here. I like how you can blow like arms and stuff off. It would, it would be really hard, I think, to get. You would have to know like preemptively where all the stuff is. Combo lost. Yeah, I know. I know I suck. You don't have to tell me. <laughs> the yeah, the Wii remote like noises are so comical to me. Ooh, I almost missed it. It was like blended in the background so much. You're welcome, man. Oh, is that not a thing? No, that's just a light. Yeah, like the... the I don't know if it's the game. Because I did notice it was hard with Epic to Mickey to make some details out. Or if it's just a Wii. I don't know for sure. Like, brighter games look, look fine. They look really good. But it's like any game... Ah, how was I supposed to know? But it's like any game that has like a lot of blacks or something, it, like you can't make anything out. And this one has a lot of overblown stuff, which it, it's going for that really contrasted, really over-saturated look. You know, that grindhouse look. I don't know if you're supposed to shoot those out of the air, but that seems impossible. I also don't know what happens. Ugh! the brain again. I don't know what happens if you die, like how far back you gotta go, like if you're in a boss battle. It would really suck ass if you've gotta go all the way back to the beginning. I ended up getting that brain, so that's what matters here. It would really suck if like, you gotta go back to the beginning of the level. I really don't know, because it's been so long since I've played it. But with how shorter, like the shorter... There was a thing back there. 
With the shortness of the levels, it makes me think that that's probably what the case is. It, it's like, I don't know, I guess the magnum, like you, the dot in the center is really where you need to aim. So it's like <laughs> kind of hard to like pinpoint that to get stuff. I got four. What happens if I get five? got the brain I'm like trying to get like the little collectible stuff get out of here man <laughs> running up on me like that like you know me or something I ain't your patient <gasps> dang it I like I see everything too quick and then I don't have the reaction time to like which is probably why I'm not good at video games I don't exactly have a oh what he's got a helmet on I don't exactly have the reaction time needed to be like sufficient at video games. I think we're going to the boss battle now. I don't know. If we get a cutscene, we're going to the boss battle. Maybe? All right, I think we're doing the boss battle. Ma'am? Ma'am, are you okay? Move aside, diaper shit! Let a man diaper handle shit. this! Motherfuck! I like that, ma'am, ma'am, are you okay? Literally, her entire spine's exposed. Screamer! It looks like head and crotch shots. <laughs> All right. Over there. Here she comes. Where did she Oh, this go? is this is creepy. I don't like this. Well, honestly, I can't see her, so I hope they don't expect me to shoot. Because I, I can't even make out where she is. God, this is a creepy boss battle. Especially, like... Especially in the, uh, like, in the sense of, like... I can't fucking see anything, man. You guys might be able to see more than me because of how I'm going to edit this together and what I'm going to do for the editing. Did we win? I think we won. Because I'm planning on, like, kind of upping the blacks and stuff so things are a little bit more visible. But yeah, I don't know. Who knows? Maybe that's how this game is. I don't know. That's not my phone. An unexpected complication. The bitch is ringing. Oh yeah, this part's gross. No motherfucking way, man. I manicured only yesterday. You manicure? What if I fucking do? These ain't going inside that bitch. No finger fucking way. Hello? Who could be behind such depravity? It's for you. Yo! Isaac, darling. Papa strikes again. As you well know, Isaac, 
I enjoy pain. It's like a good Chinese dinner, you know, with the sweet and the sour. Expanding on that analogy, I will smile with delight. That's the sweet. As you scream for your fucking life. Of course, that's the sour. Ciao. Mad motherfucker. Shit! The place is wired to blow! We're not dead yet, detective! The music slaps in this. It's that very, like, surfery... Heavy reverb, heavy reverb, reverb, reverb. Can't pronounce anything today. A howling hellcat humping a hot steel. <laughs> a howling hellcat humping a hot steel hog. Hey you! <laughs> I, I I gotta remember to say that from now on as like an actual a phrase of wording. Oh, I forgot what it was now. A humping hellcat riding a hot steel raw hog. How much cash did I get? I don't feel like I probably got a very lot out of that one. Oh shoot, I did. <gasps> did I get enough to get the shotgun? No. Anyway, I think that's going to be the end of... <laughs> Not even close to the top. The end of uh, episode 2 of House of the Dead Overkill. If you guys have enjoyed it so far. If you have, pressing that thumbs up button and subscribing goes a long way in helping my channel out. I would greatly appreciate it. And uh, I'll try not to destroy the Wii sensor cord with my foot as I was just like rolling it around. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.